from the cool TV studios in Lagos, and from the worldwide resources of I Missed It News, here is Red Eye, a show that looks over the stories you may have overlooked. Today on Red Eye, who would have thought burglars had a sense of humor? Underwears are only meant to be worn, or are they? Have you ever heard that it is rude to stare? So sit back and take off your shoes, or maybe not. Yes, it's a Saturday night. If you're home bored and crying, oh, where should I go? Don't think about it. We're all the fun you need. Welcome to Red Eye. And of course, I'm not alone. I have this team that will give you all the fun you need in this life or not. <laughs> By my rights, we have, every time I see this guy, thank God for civilization. If not, he would have been a pan wine tapper. <laughs> I'll be mixing up all drugs together for people. We have Jeff. Hold out for me to see. Dear Jeff, sometimes. How are you doing, viewers? You're welcome to your number one, number one, number one program. You know, I'm the only traditionalist in the studio, you know, the learned traditional man. Thank you very much, Today Jeff. I said it all. And then we have the mysterious one. This lady, when you look at her, you think, oh, I know everything about her. Trust me, you have loads and loads of books to read. If you've seen that dictionary that describes women, we have Ginika. Hi, she said it all. I was just thinking that compliment. <laughs> And then, uh, for this guy, I mean, if you have this head, you have to be serious. So this is our serious and witty one, Chukudi Ezu Ogo. <laughs> Hi, everybody. I'm a serious member of the panel. You can tell by my expression. OK, thank you very much. And then you have, <laughs> and then you have me, Titi Layo Amakulo. So let's go straight into our first story. And this one has to do with Career choices. I mean, I love my career, but by the way, you're looking good. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you didn't point that out when she was introducing you. <laughs> career choices. You're looking good to Guinea. I know, yeah, right? Looking good. I know oh you're waiting for yours. <laughs> Guinea, no. what's your what's your career choice? I mean, are you doing what you love? Mm. Actually, yes, because if I was not doing what <laughs> Yes. No, you don't have to be scared. We know our <laughs> end here. Everybody watching. You don't say the truth. Speak your well, mind. Well, I am yeah. doing what I love, which is why I can. I'm very patient with some things, and I can dare a lot of things. So yes, I am doing what you love. So ensure that you do what you love, okay, guys? You're doing what they love, or what you I'm love. I'm doing what I love. Okay. You, have you to want to do what I love no, too? No, I would love to do what you do. Okay. okay. So I, I don't know what's going on between both of them. I don't know. <laughs> going into our first story, I mean, career choices are very important, and every career, even if you dig pits. Is very important to the world. Now we have this guy, Philip Wells. Oh no, the name of the dog is Philip Wells. <laughs> but the guy is a dog food tester. Wow. Mm. He even has a favorite uh, recipe. He has a, you know, the lamb and peas. He likes it. He said it, it contains low fat. Wow. So your, your dog will not be obese. Wow. <laughs> a dog, a dog food what, what's the name of the man? How come they no, get his name is Philip Wells, actually. Oh, his okay, he's Philip oh, Wells. Yes. So what's the name of the dog? The dog is um, nameless. Oh, the loving dog. dog. The loving it's dog. Yes. Any dog that wants to Sorry. You know what, I, I think this I man is only fulfilling. Choice. You want to change your words? I think words. I want to be a dog, <laughs> a dog food tester. Because <laughs> I just sleep, yeah. wake up, and you just bring everything, yeah. or choke on it, and vomit, and, and one day it. you start barking again like a dog now. I, I, <laughs> it's true now. The man will come back now. <laughs> you know, yeah. funny enough, these dogs are more healthy than most people. Let's wow. face the truth. I don't know, I mean, this is an inside joke, but have you guys seen that black dog down the street? I mean, that dog is, is the dumbest dog I've ever seen. <laughs> is it what? The, that dog is dumb. No, Why would that you dog is, that, the dog, dog is really I very healthy. Very that dog. The dog has a healthy lifestyle. We will take it for walk. Have you seen that dog in the evening? That's what Ibo would call a cookie. <laughs> that dog. <laughs> that, <laughs> that, dog. <laughs> that, that dog is. The dog is bigger than the cookie. But what do you guys think I about his career choice? Don't you think? I think it's good. I think it's fabulous. I want to change mine, and I want to be a dog food tester. For me, I think every 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 employee should emulate this man. It's even written in the Bible that show me a man that is diligent in, in his, you understand? <laughs> this is somebody who is doing something ordinary in an extraordinary way, mm -hmm. ensuring that the dogs get all the love. Deep. Some, yeah. deep, deep. How is dogs? Deep. That, that man should try that here in Nigeria. Yeah? There's nothing as in he's gone. 
Why? Hunger will just finish it. <laughs> no, no, dog food. That means that food now. Yeah, 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 Dog food here in Nigeria is leftover with chicken and bone when everybody is Okay, speaking about saying? dogs, uh, you were saying the guy would die, but you should know that there are some rich dogs in this world because this lady, mm. uh, Bella Maya, she left a, a fortune for her dog and we're talking 14 million. Wait, is this 14? No, mm -hmm. 1 million mm -hmm. euros for the dog. Jesus. Mm. 1 That's million euros. euros for the dog. Chukudi, please convert. No, no, don't call me Chukudi. Call me, call me dog. Please convert. <laughs> no, no, don't call me Chukudi. Call me dog. Call me dog. <laughs> Convert, convert. One Another million conversion. euros. Oh my God. Yes. What is your task for a dog? For a dog. Yes, I so want to be a dog. She, she like said that. the dog is used to the lifestyle, you know. She doesn't want the dog to, what to is begin wrong with to all suffer these when now. she goes. What is wrong with all these people? I don't understand. It's not her money. She'll give the money to who deserves it now. So who will manage the money for the dog? Who will be managing the money now? <laughs> Jeff, I have a solution for you. Instead of going, what is wrong with this? When you die, pray that you come back as a dog. My no, no, dog. No. Pray that not, you come back not, as the manager as of the dog. Because dog. if a certain man was managing this dog, he would have oh, yeah, had shoes when he was going up. Wow. I'm telling you. <laughs> so wait, but because this <laughs> dog was not around, oh there, was, there are lack of shoes. <laughs> so the woman that doesn't have any relative. <laughs> No brothers, no sisters, nothing. No, some All dogs are better than human beings. Ah, ah, titi. Oh, is that true now? No, no, that's wicked now. So I'm not saying it's not fair. This dog is better than quite a... As Thank a you. Of fact, this dog is very attractive. Sorry, hold on. You know this dog is better than all of us together. No, no, no. Don't say that, my dear. Don't say that. What's wrong with that? Why am I saying that? No, you're not tripping for a dog. You're not tripping for a dog. No, Ginika, do you know what? We're girls. The dog is more attractive than both of them together right now. Actually, yes. Trust me, I love that. I'm in love with that dog. The dog is more attractive. Why are you crying? Why are you crying? Why you you know what? You know, get I think you ladies should look. You, you ladies should, we should look potential. at your eyes. No, no, take potential. Take potential. potential. Take potential. Yeah. Over dog. Take potential but over the dog. dog. I can already see its future. Do you know what, Guinea? They are talking <laughs> about taking potential over dog. Meanwhile, when they well, see a pretty lady, oh, yes. they go for her and forget the potentials of, of what the ordinary exactly? people. See, see, I know that now, cannot happen in my country. No, no, sorry. See what this mayor did. He's the mm. mayor from one Bud Budapest right. district. Now he wants only hot ladies with hot legs to wear short skirts that are above the knees. He has two my three centimeters. He, has my he doesn't want if you know you have big legs, please do not do not wear short skirts. My two hands are no, up. Yeah. He I, has I, my votes. I, well, I, I, I concur. He, he I support also support. has my votes. No, so we vote for you people nice for ladies. No, no, no but I agree because I know that I have hot legs. I can't shout. Wait for me to say it now. I was about to say it. So just Wait, it. I know uh -huh. that I have hot legs, but imagine having to see uh, someone else, uh -huh. you know, with very unattractive legs. Are you referring to Titi? No, no, Titi. Oh, 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 Thing into Lagos, it will be a very Only welcome development. No, Nigeria will move forward this way. So no, but you know it will be discriminating against ego ladies because they are naturally Excuse blessed with yams. You. The Excuse yams are sexy. Uh, sexy. Yeah? Sorry, Angela Jolie has yams. Oh. Sarah Jessica Parker has... Give me a please show this guy your legs. I would love to. <laughs> no, I'm <laughs> seeing it from you. Don't worry. I can see it Sorry, from you. Sorry, please show us where you carry... Not where you carry from the yam on your leg. Though. No, no, no. Some no, yams, no. Like, like something like say? this is okay. That one doesn't work. It cannot, <laughs> cannot take us to the permanent site. <laughs> you better not get a traditionalist like Jeff. No, no, no. If things become difficult, you're cooking the yams. I'm telling you. So, what are on the... Just asking out of the blues, what are underwears made for? To no. protect the the rear, the no, to you know. Yeah, it protects that place, but we know yes, that, that inner time. place, how does your husband handle it? Some husbands use your mouth uh, different things. Okay, what I'm trying wow. to say is that, <laughs> uh, what I'm trying to say <laughs> well also. is that this man ate his underwear. He's an 18-year-old man. Mm -hmm. I notice they called him man because when you're 18 in Nigeria, you're a man, you're not a small boy. Anyway, he ate it thinking that the cotton will help take away the, the, the drugs in him before they actually come and perform what they call breathalyzer. Are you kidding wow. me? <laughs> Sorry, I want to ask a question. That one is, was it, <clears throat> is it a clean one or? They say he ate his own on this. Your own his own. Own. They clean on this, yes. I have, oh. I have something else, right? What if it was a woman and she was on her period? I don't mean to sound gross. Ouch. And she was on her period and, you know, she was the one going through that. Would you advise that she eat it to, you know? Well, the period is coming out of, you're out of use. So. I, I think it's no, desperate no, situation it's, just call for desperate measures. Measure. She was going to take the breathalyzer test mm. and if his, you the know, if, he, if go his go breath general. exceeds the alcohol limit, mm. he'll be arrested. So and he, he just decided to take the easy way out. Yeah, I mean, easy. it's his so own way. So that's the escape route for him. 
That's his underwear now, you know, so some, there's no some problem. Some situations are not desperate because while my sister was in Benin, they mm. caught this guy that was always stealing their dirty pants that they keep in. When they go to their, for their lectures, you go into their room, steal the pants. He had a Ghana must go full of dirty pants that he would just perceive as... And... and, 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 uh, and, and just no, it's normal. He has a fetish for, for female on these. Fetish? Yeah, people do. People so, have a lot of crazy fetishes. What, what's your crazy fetish? Handcuffs. Toes. Do you like, you know, nibbling on toes? I, I love that, you know... When you, spanking. I love spanking. <laughs> See, no, hold on. You spank with... I love no, spank, spank, spank spanking spanking with the hand. You <laughs> no, do it like this. You can spank with the hand or you... you okay. <laughs> two ways. Look at his smile when he says that. Okay, nothing. anyway, guys, um, it's been fun so Whoa. far. Let's take a quick break and we'll be back with the rest of our story for today. Stay tuned. Here is Red Eye.